So let's learn how to make our podcast sound good in Adobe Audition. And this is pretty simple. All you're going to have to do is go down to File, New, Multitrack Session, and then I want you to select Podcast. That's where I am right now. And when you're in Podcast, it's going to prompt you to make a 30-second intro and a 30-second outro to keep things consistent as a good general rule. Um, so you're able to do that. Just record those, and then you can drag them in here. But at the same time, it's going to have a place for your host to speak. It's going to have a place for your interviews and your sound effects. The sound effects have dynamics processing on it, and they also have parametric equalizer. So I'd say everything is pretty much set up here for you to sound great. Uh, but let's go over some of the basics. If you want to sound even better and you want more resonance in your voice, what you need to do is go into, um, specifically, you can go into filter and EQ, parametric equalizer for the host voice, and then go into loudness maximizer. This is great. And vocal enhancer. These two are gonna make you sound a lot better if you apply them to your voice. So definitely uh, try that out and give it a shot because that's really going to make you uh, sound better. You probably don't need this though, so remove the effect and just start with a speech volume leveler um, and the other tools and you're gonna sound really great. Uh, feel free to use that though if you need to. Uh, and also your sound effects do have that parametric equalizer on it. So you can actually drag your audio down there and sample it to see what it sounds like. Um, just right up here, and we're going to make sure, okay, it's the right way. Watch this. Let's become experts at Adobe Audition. It just has a lot of resonance in it, so it sounds really good. If you like that, you can change the host voice as well. Uh, but this will set you up for a podcast. It's a great template. Um, and now that you know how to make your own templates, you can edit this the way you want. I'd say start with this as your bread and butter, as your foundation, and then edit this the way that you want by dragging in your own effects, your own mastering, depending on the podcast that you're recording, and then export as template like I showed you to. Um, go to export um, session as template and you can save this to my podcast or just write the name of your podcast and leave off where you started. Good luck.